Do you guys see how it's all starting to come together and how the shopping annuity is really starting to take flight? So we're not stopping. We're going to keep going. Just like he said, we're going to keep going. We're going to keep delivering until this is so easy that there's no reason not to do it. There's nothing to quit. You're shopping. You're buying it anyway. And we're just going to keep going until we get it. Do you guys like all the new products? Do you like to sell products? Use products? All right, so JR's been talking for quite some time about these four concepts coming together, right? And these four concepts really are what make the shopping annuity work. It's the synergy of it all and everything else. So we're going to talk about those four pieces again today. We're going to talk about the digital aggregation pieces. We're going to talk about product matching. We're going to talk about what we call Uberization. And then we're going to talk a little bit about the concierge program too. Again, this is all synergy. This is everything coming together and finally delivering something that's just going to make this business completely blow up. So the digital aggregation piece. Mark talked a little bit about it. You guys have heard about it for the last few events. Everything is around you guys. We want your vote and we want your voice to be what controls what products we're bringing out. Super IBV products, IBV products that Mark just talked about, and even BV products, right? Your vote and your voice is what's telling us to what to go find. So we need you guys to keep voting. We need you to flex your collective buying power. And we, we are listening, so don't stop, because it's going to change the game of the shopping annuity. Product matching and narrowing. This is something that we've been talking about. I'm actually going to show you a good, a good amount of it today for things that we're doing that are going to make everything that Mark just showed you easier. Because it's going to be impossible not to find the right products on the site. Our margins are going to go up. All of it's going to take off. Now, right now, on the site today, we have 50 million products. Is 50 million products too much? 12 million products too much. So that's what we have right now. It's 50 million products. 12 million is actually our one carts. What if we make that focus easy and we make it easy for you guys to narrow into the right 12 million products for this consumable venture that we're talking about? Is that going to make it easier? Yeah. All right. Uberization, it's a term we've been using. It's all about making it simple. We need to make shopping so easy on all of our sites that there's nothing to quit. You don't have to do anything. You don't have to think. We find the products for you. We put them in front of you. We make it easy. So we're going to talk about that. Steve's actually going to come up tomorrow. Steve's going to talk a lot more about the concierge program and how we'll actually have someone assist you in finding the right products. So we're going to touch on that. All right, digital aggregation. Again, this is you guys collecting your, this is you guys flexing your collective buying power, and we need to keep that going. I know there's a booth upstairs, the shopping annuity booth, and we have another poll going on this time. Keep using your voice and keep voting because it's going to change the products we're bringing in and increase margins. Um, Howard, will you roll this video, please? Shopping annuity is revolutionizing the economy by helping consumers wield our collective buying power so everyone can grab a piece of the profit margin. We're making this concept even more powerful by developing exclusive shopping annuity brand products. Market America and Shop.com are all about people power. So we're giving consumers the power to help decide what new products we create with a three-step process. Step one, nominate and narrow category choices for new products you'd like us to create with higher BV and IBV for unfranchised owners and more cash back for customers. This leads us to the best consumable products from the right vendors. Step two, vote for the nominated products by committing to buy them through our pre-order process. Step three, we launch the new products you wanted. We're empowering consumers through digital aggregation to have a voice in identifying products they need and want. It's part of our DNA as unfranchised owners to utilize our collective buying power. So share your input and help us create the products to help you convert your spending into earning and build your shopping annuity. Thank you, Howard. All right, guys, the point of this is it's you that's going to control the products we're bringing in. It's you that's going to control the margins. So everything that Mark just talked about and us flexing our collective buying power, 
If we get everyone in this room, or we get 100,000 people, or 200,000 people to buy the same products, our margins will increase. We will make more money. We will make more BV, more IBV. We need you guys to understand that concept. So Mark went through the products. I'm not going to go through them all again. But again, we need you to understand that it's your vote that delivered this. This was the original poll that we did two events ago. You are in control! Yeah. It's people power! Anything you want, we can get more IBV on, more BV, lower price if we all combine together. It's people power, digital aggregation. We are connected. The establishment doesn't want us to be connected because we have muscle when we buy together. Convert your spending into earning. Vote, 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 vote. Do you got it? They got it. Thanks, JR. Again, it's the voting. You guys asked for it two conventions ago. We delivered. So you asked for deodorant. We delivered. You asked for hand soap. We delivered. You guys asked for coffee. We delivered. Mark just presented all these. So again, if you keep asking, we will keep delivering. And I think Mark just showed you that all of those were right about 50% margin for consumable products that you use every day. 50% margins on the volume that's going to pay you and everyone in your organization. You guys get that. And that came from you guys voting on it. So keep voting. Shopping Nudity brand, we've seen a lot of great posts, people are really liking it, um, and it's changing the game. Product matching and narrowing. So we just talked a little bit about the 50 million products we have on the site, 12 million one-cart products. Does it take time to find products when you're looking on the site, when you're trying to find cereal or pastas, toothpaste? That one doesn't take time. You got the toothpaste. Paper towels, toilet paper. So the whole idea of what we're trying to do with this narrowing is find the right consumables and make them easy for you guys to find it. So we started looking at changing our business model a little bit on this. And we started thinking about what we could do to be better. Does anybody in here shop at Costco? Have you shopped at Costco? When you walk down the aisles at Costco, you don't see 20 different toothpaste and 15 different paper towels. You see one or two or three, right? They pick the best brand. They'll have their Kirkland brand, and then they'll have their bounty and the paper towels. They narrow choices so that people are buying more. We want to do that too. So we actually have spent the last six months, uh, we've made a lot of progress working with Gene and Michael and the IT teams, but we have more to go, and you're going to see in the very near future that it's going to become way easier to find all of those products because we are going to do what Costco did on our site, and we're going to narrow that down to the right consumable products. So we did, we did a lot of stuff to figure out how to do this. So we worked, we had a lot of summits. We had a lot of IT brains coming together on it. But the whole idea is that we took your feedback. You know, Sarah and myself, we've done a lot with polling uh, some of our ambassadors and some others about problems with shopping on the site. And we listened to it. Uh, and we took it to IT. You know, there was a lot of concern about taking time to find the pro right products. Too many, like, commercial-sized bulk items. Does anybody want to buy 12 things of ketchup? No. I mean, you could buy a few, maybe, but not, probably not 12. That's a, most people, that's probably a year's supply of ketchup. So it just took too, too, too long to find, hard to find the best offer, and... Sometimes you couldn't tell if even you found the best offer or if it even had free shipping, right? So uh, we wanted to fix all that. So we started looking at creative ways to fix all of those problems that you guys brought to us. So we studied eight different data points. I'm not going to go into all of the data behind this, but we wanted to look at order data, right? What one cart products were we selling? What is being used on our site? What's moving? So we looked at a lot of products. We looked at a lot of orders to understand what are the right products, what are the right brands, and what are the right categories for these consumable products. And then we looked at shipping. Is shipping an issue when you're looking at those 50 million products on the site? Sometimes you see free shipping. Other times you get to the cart 
and shipping is not pleasant, right? We took in all of those into concerns and uh, we're weighing options on it. So as Mark brought up in his last presentation uh, about the products, if it's not free shipping anymore or doesn't have a free shipping threshold, it's coming off our site. We're not going to have the products out there that you guys are going to have to fight for and find shipping stuff. So then we looked at brands, right? Brands are important. Talked about it a minute ago with the Costco model. They're going to have bounty paper towels, but they're also going to have their brand. We will look at that. And Mark showed you a lot of that just now with the, some of the generic stuff that we're coming up with. But brand affinity is important for certain products and looking at the right consumables. So uh, we took that into points. Compelling price. Are all the products you find on our site, these one cards, are they always price competitive? I'm going to take no answer as they must be. But we got a lot of feedback that the, the prices weren't always competitive. Um, and so what we did was looked into a pricing algorithm and what we could do to figure out if the price is competitive for what other ver merchants in this area are doing. Then we looked at data, right? If you can't find the product by searching, a lot of it's just due to the fact that we didn't have the right data on that product. Product descriptions are important. There's a lot of other attributes in it. So we looked into all that when we were getting into this as well. Then we looked into product options. Sometimes a product with too many options and too many choices makes it hard to make that buying decision. We talked about removing bulk. We will have some things in bulk, like you can buy something that's a, you know, paper towels is a good example. There's probably 16 rolls, and that's what a normal family would use in a quarter or uh, even a few months, right? Um, a couple months. But other things like the ketchup example I just bought, we want to take those off the site. So all those went into it. Well, then we took Jet. Jet is leading the space in this consumables right now. And we took Jet, Walmart, and Amazon's data, and we brought it in, and we did a lot of stuff to take that data and compare it to the products on our site and find what was relative. Um, and what we ended up with doing was a drastic reduction of products. To be honest, we took that 12 million one-cart number, and when we did our analysis on it, we ended up with about 12,000 products. So a drastic reduction, but they're the right products. So example right now is paper towels. If you search paper towels on our site today, you get 648 results from over 40 different stores. Is it hard to make a decision when you get that many choices? You have to compare every variable. Is it price competitive? Did it offer shipping? Etc. So with the new analysis we've done, we're taking that result set down to four. Again, like the Costco model, four paper towels from three stores, all with free shipping, all price competitive. If it's not in a variance point of less than 10% of Jet or Walmart or Amazon, it came off. And this is a decision we're making, so it's going to make all of the products in these consumables a lot easier. Same thing for toilet paper, 472 results from over 40 stores. New, after the reduction, five. A couple brands you recognize, but then also like the Kirkland model, right, from Costco, from three stores. So all this is what we're taking into account to get into that. Uh, we had to look at reduction of categories. So we started our reduction of categories already, and this is actually live on the site right now. When new unfranchised owners take the assessment, which now you can take with your prospects online with shoppingannuity.com, but when you, new people go through the um, shopping annuity assessment and they go through it, before we had a lot of categories. There was, over a, there was 100 categories. We now have reduced that to 37 categories. And why? We're just trying to make it easier to identify where in your house you're already using products that you now can buy at, at BV, but also at wholesale. So stop buying them from Walgreens and Target and now buy them from you uh, and get wholesale. Drastic reduction in products. Before we were recommending over 150 products to new UFOs and prospects that were going through it. Now there's 111. Why? Because when you say you use digestive health, I don't want to give you seven different digestive products. I want to give you our top ones. So now when you go through the assessment, you're going to see isotonics, digestive enzyme with probiotics. You're going to see the new probiotic 10, and you're going to see aloe. That's it. You won't see all the choices you were seeing before. So we're not just doing it with the partner products, drastic reduction of the BV categories and what we're trying to do with the assessment. Talking a little bit, Uberization. How do we make it easier to find the products? Does anybody remember using this version of Unfranchise on the mobile phone? 
couldn't really get to everything. A lot of things weren't accessible, certainly weren't able to merchandise and market, much less shop on this page. Well, I don't know if you guys have seen, anybody pulled out your mobile phone or a tablet or anything and seen the new homepage in the last couple weeks, last month? The new homepage is completely responsive. What that means is that works on all devices. When our developers and our IT team are coding it, they're coding it for four different views, which anything from a 4K TV all the way down to the smallest phone. What's great about that is now we can give you everything that you wanted and you had to dig into before all on the homepage. So all of your report widgets, everything on the homepage. You can click into it. You're going to be able to customize those. We're actually going live sometime next week with customization, where you can pick the order of the widgets you want. You can pick which widgets you want to display and which widgets you don't. So what else do we do on the home page? Our events are important, right? And selling tickets to those events are important. Well, now we're able to merchandise and market the ticket sales on those pages. So we can hit all, anything that we want to hit on this page, whether it's a, a product, you know, ticket, you buy three tickets and you get $500 in products, anything else that you before had to get to a page and you couldn't even access it on a mobile device, we're able to hit them on this page. We're also able to hit the collective buying power and the pre-order stuff. What else are we doing? We're merchandising products. So this is the first step of finding products that you want and putting them in front of you. So we're working right now on personalizing all of these products, but what we're doing now is literally merchandising. And these things, they change every week. We have an entire team that's merchandising the right consumable products based on the time of the year, traveling for the event, everything else. Our products, same thing. We're putting our top products on this page and we're putting our top IBV picks. These are all part of these products that I just went through in the product narrowing. So if you're seeing products on the home page, they're the ones that went through in the algorithm and were narrowed down. So you can trust that they're competitive, you can trust that they offer free shipping, and you can trust that it's the right product for whatever we're marketing for. <clears throat> one thing that we've done, this was a search for OPC3. We've talked about this one in the past. Uh, this one also is in active development. It's actually going live in a few weeks. This is the dual search. So search, now when you search for products, you search OPC3 in that global header you get OPC3 products. You might not know, and new, new UFOs might not know, that there's an audio download of JR talking about it, that there's PDFs and there's sales materials and there's support materials for OPC3. We are now going to be doing a dual search on everything that you type in Unfranchise, and we'll be returning to you all of the support materials on the second tab. <laughs> Global search works on all devices is on every single page of Unfranchise. So you might not have known that there was a great sales aid for OPC3. Well, now we're going to show it to you. All right. Media. Sarah's talked about this one already. You guys have seen it before. Actually, the new media pages. Um, Sarah, did that just go live, or is it going live? The media pages is going live. We're, we've been testing it in production, um, and it's going to be rolling out very soon. So, again, the media results will be popping up on the second tab of everything you do. Do you guys like having to go to shop every time you want to link off and go to Target, go to Walmart, go to Sears? We've now brought all of those partners into Unfranchise. This went live last week. So you never have to go worry about linking off to an affiliate. You can go to Unfranchise, click on it, all of the t all the tagging and all the... The same attributes that were passed when you left shop.com to go are now in Unfranchise. You don't have to worry about missing out on IBV. Those results show right now, live, any search that you do. We got feedback about search and type ahead. Um, you guys right now, when you're doing a search in Unfranchise, you were able to see OPC3. But if you started looking for soap or you started looking for toilet paper, we actually didn't have that same technology that we put on shop. So this went live this past week as well, where we'll now do type ahead and we'll actually show you, based on our brands and that narrowing that we just talked about, all of the appropriate categories or products that we have. Is this making it easier to shop? Do you think that's going to help fuel the shopping annuity? <clears throat> more BV, more IBV. That's the goal. All right. 
We got to uh, talk about shipping when we were talking about uh, the product narrowing. Before on Unfranchise, could you find out if a vendor had free shipping or not? Could you find out any attributes around that, product, that partner? You actually couldn't. You had to go to shop.com to click on the store, figure out if that store had free shipping. Well, went live with the free shipping thing. And now you can see on every single search result, every single product detail page, every quick view, if that store has free shipping, what the threshold is, and all of the information associated with it. Again, we want to make Unfranchise your go-to destination, and we want to make it simple to shop. All right, vendor information. Same thing that I was just talking about before when you were actually doing a search on the site and you were trying to find information around a product or a vendor, you couldn't. Well, we've actually added that in now on the product detail pages uh, and you'll be able to see the vendor information. Uh, and you'll be able to see the vendor information for the store, shipping information, return policies, all the information that you used to have to go through and go to shop.com for. So we brought it all in on franchise. This is actually something that's um, in the works right now. So we're going to talk about it. We talked about it before. Shop.com went live with this piece. And when you're searching on the site and you add products to your cart, you'll see that that cart follows you in and out, right? And it pops out. And you can see the products you've added to it. We're in development right now on Unfranchise with what we call a sticky cart, which has the My List, which has the cart, and it has an auto ship process. The reason why is because we know sometimes it takes time to find the right products to build lists for your consumable products. When you go grocery shopping, do you create a list? What if the site made it easy for you to create and manage those lists? So when you were dealing with a kitchen pantry or you were dealing with anything else, when you select that list and that list is now active, everything on the site with a single click of the button, you can add to the kitchen pantry list. So when you're going through and you're putting together your pastas and you're putting together your sauces and you're putting together everything, literally the sidekick will follow you around. And if you have kitchen pantry, kitchen pantry selected, the sidekick literally with a single button will be able to add anything to a list. Easier way to check out, easier, faster, simpler. It's about the shopping annuity. My list has been a big focus of it. We've integrated the My List functionality into all of the different auto ships. It's actually integrated in the primary auto ships now, and it's integrated in the shopping annuity auto ships. Because understanding where you have these items in your house um, and what they're used for and how often they, they're consumed is an important part of the buying decision. So we've added some attributes to the My List stuff, um, and it's all of this stuff is coming soon, the My List piece anyway, meaning you're going to be able to put in the, that. 16 rolls of paper towels last a quarter. The reason why is because when you're going to reorder, there's different things you order every week than you know, your oatmeal and your cereals than things you're going to order every quarter. So we're gonna, it's all about making it easier to manage all of these consumable purchases. So that's what this whole page is going to be doing. What about reordering? Would you get, would, do you guys like to be reminded of a product that you're running out of? Yes. So this actually went live this past week. We now will send you a push notification with a link to a reorder page on Unfranchise. This is also fully responsive and works on every single device. So when you're running out of Snap or OPC3, you'll now get a link and you'll click it and it will literally open and render properly in any device with a single page that has all of the products that you've ordered in the last 15 months sorted sequentially based on the most recent one down. Again, we want to make it easier. Most people are buying the same products on an ongoing basis. We want to make it easier. Does that make sense? Do you guys like easier? Do you want the shopping annuity to be easier? Do you want more volume in your organizations? All right, so we're trying to deliver on a lot of that stuff. But again, the reorder page works on all devices. One thing that we're working on with the personalization as well as the narrowing that we just talked about is merchandising concepts and being able to merchandise the right products to people based on their own affinity. Kevin buys a different type of clothes than Andrew buys. Joe buys a different kind of food than JR buys, right? We want to personalize your entire experience. And we've been working with 
uh, new data scientists have been, have been hired. And we've been working with data. Uh, and Michael and Gina have been doing a fabulous job running with it. In the near future, we're, we're manually merchandising stuff right now. In the near future, literally based on your brand affinity, purchasing behavior, and everything else, we will be completely customizing your shopping experience and unfranchise. Handpicked products. We'll be focusing on things like a cleaning Wednesday and a pasta Tuesday. We want it to be so fun when you come to the site, you'll see the savings. You'll see prepackaged lists that with single clicks, you can add the whole package. You can say, I only want these four products out of the five. You can only want you know, these three products. And we make it so easy for you to spend money. We're not just doing that on our on franchise. We want to do that on customer-facing sites too. So what if your customers come to the site every week and they get a new deal and they see the savings, both monetary and a value for time value, so that the site has a perceived value of saving them money on doing what they're already doing anyway. Will that make it easier for you guys to have customers come to the site? Easier for yourself? All right, so these same lists and collections uh, are already being marketed on the homepage of Unfranchise, and we're going live literally uh, in the next couple of weeks with an admin tool that's going to help us do it on more pages than just those single ones. Things we're doing right now to sell more product on the site, we're using a tool that allows us to interject the results in different areas of the site. So we went live with this one a couple, uh, actually last week. When you search aloe right now, <clears throat> you just get aloe, right? And if you click on our drinkable, ingestible aloe, you see that product. What we wanted to do is take our top selling products and ingest those other products on the page because people not, might not realize for digestive health that we actually have our isotonic probiotic, right? Might not realize our new pro probiotic 10. So we're now injecting all of our top selling products around these certain algorithms. So any one of those four digestive products that you would land on would show you the other three as a, as a suggestion. Again, it's about educating, getting the right products in front of people. Same thing in search results. We're taking search results now and we're injecting in our top selling products at the top of that result. We're making it easy for you guys to find the right BV products. Again, these are sorted based on sales data. So the data that's there, and these are all live right now. You can search on any, any one of these. Um, we're looking right now at Digestive Health and OPC3, or we'll return all of those. Same thing for weight management and beauty. Same thing for children's health, isotonics. We're taking all of our top search terms and top brands and top categories, Snap, and we're putting our top selling products up top, easy to interface with, right in your face. You can't miss it. It's so making it easier to find the right BV products. The concierge program, I'm going to let Steve talk about it. JR's hit on it a couple of times, and we talked a little bit about it last time. The idea of the concierge program is if you're decorating a house or you're building a grocery list, it's sometimes easier to have someone help you out with that process. So Steve's going to cover this one uh, in, in the conversations tomorrow with Mark. So I'm just going to leave it at there. Um, but do you guys get the concepts that we're doing and how we're making shopping easier? Do you see JR's vision of the shopping annuity now coming to life with everything that we're delivering? All the products that Mark just delivered, all of that increased IBV, all of the new SABV products, all of the new cutting edge BV products, and all this technology to make it easier for you guys to search to find and to consume those products. We're doing it in Unfranchise, but we're also doing all the same stuff on Shop, so it's gonna make it easier for you to keep and maintain happy customers. So, that's all I have. Thank you very much.